Tag, you're it. <laughs> Hello, everybody. It's Tag Tuesday again, and we got tagged to, to do the food tag by none other than Dana Bisa. Let's come up with a shorter tag list. Question number one. What is your favorite breakfast? Uh, Rice Krispie Treats and coffee. Bacon and eggs or corned beef hash and eggs? How do you drink your coffee? Uh, two sugars. I don't drink coffee. What is your favorite sandwich? Subway sandwich, uh, the chicken with jalapenos and uh, Southwest sauce. And it's, that's it. Whatever he makes for me because he makes the most delicious sandwiches. Okay. Love his sandwiches. Super salad. Salad. All depends where I'm at. French onion soup. Cream of broccoli soup or salad. Uh, favorite cookbook? Uh, to Serve Man. <laughs> Dead Bird. <laughs> see, see, see if you re know that reference. <laughs> to Serve Man is a cookbook! <laughs> Mine is um, our own that we're writing called Dead Bird Recipes. <laughs> Just kidding, we're not really writing a, a, a dead bird cookbook. You kill it, we'll cook it. <laughs> if you could have no more sweets or no more savory food. One or the other, I'd probably stick with the savory. Stay away from the sweets. Yeah, same here. What's your favorite type of food? Mexican. Seafood. Favorite cooking show? We don't watch cooking shows. No. We don't watch cooking shows, but I do... Um, Agree with Dana B. Saw. I watched Meet the Presleys on their cooking channel, and I would have to say that that is one of my favorite cooking shows because, yeah, it is a show. Ultimate guilty pleasure? Uh, probably ice cream sandwiches. Lobster. Who is your cooking inspiration? I wouldn't say I have a cooking inspiration. I learned a lot of things from my mother, um, my ex-mother-in-law, and just learning on my own. Um, High-end or low-profile food? Low-profile for sure. Yeah, I would say low-profile too. I'm not a big... High-end tends actually to be less, if not as good for you. <laughs> yeah. The only high-end food I eat is, is lobster, and I don't get to do that very often. Favorite restaurant? Um, right now, um, it would probably be Miguel Dinner. Mine's Red Lobster, of course. Of course. Uh, where do we get our groceries at? Stater Brothers and Walmart. Agreed. And the best thing you've ever eaten. Ever, ever. Best thing you've ever tasted. I'm really not that into food, so I can't say that it's something absolutely like I have to have or anything. I can't say that, but right now I've been craving really, really bad baked mussels from the seafood restaurant that Megan and I usually go to. Uh, favorite snack? Right now, it, uh, I'm snacking on Rolos. Uh, red vines and ice cream sandwiches. And sour things. Oh, sour, uh, yeah, sour uh, crawlers or whatever they're called. Um, I would have to say my favorite snack is any sort of salty food. I like chips a lot. I love salty foods. What is your favorite type of pizza? Um, the uh, loaded. The ones that... Um, have everything on except fish. A anything but fish goes. I'm not sure the name of the place, but Nikki and John took us someplace, okay. and I had a slice of pizza with onions, mushrooms, and chicken on it, and it was good, very good. I would go for that again. Uh, your favorite food vlog? Again, we don't really watch food vlogs, so except, I would have to... Except for... Uh, meet uh, the Presleys. Meet the Presleys. So I would have to go with Meet the Presleys. Craziest thing you've ever eaten? Um, 
I can't say I've really eaten crazy things, except maybe escargot. Um. Snails. Yeah, I can't. I never ate snails. Um. I would have to say oyster shooters, but that's more of a drink. <laughs> But, yeah, I guess that's the craziest thing. Food bucket list. Something on your list, food bucket, that you really want to try. I don't got anything. I don't either. Something you cannot live without. A food you cannot live without. <laughs> Ted Bird. <laughs> um... Yeah, I guess I'd have to say dead bird, too, because we either buy it cooked, pre-cooked, we either get it at El Pollo Loco, KFC, the store, or we buy it and cook it a lot. So, yeah. Good for you. Dead bird. So, Tastes good. That is all the questions we have on the food tag, and we tag... Lucy Owl, Christopher Trade Show, and Katie Caroline. And then the answers will be, what, one more question is, what's the hottest chili you ever ate? Ha, yeah. Well, we're going to add that one to the list. The final question is, what is the hottest chili you've ever eaten? Without sticking it in your eye. <laughs> Without sticking it in your eye, Lucy. <laughs> so that concludes this version of Tag Tuesday, and we will see you guys next week.